The Spencerville Bearcats have been playing football in the Northwest Conference for 67 years, yet have only three league titles in that time, 1963, 72, and 96. A win tonight at Crestview and the undefeated Bearcats will clinch at least a share of this year's crown, while the Knights, coming off their first loss of the year, are going to bounce back and keep their hopes alive for a shared title. See this game coming up right after us on the Sports Report. As we hit Crestview, final home game for the Knights. Bearcats ball first, third and short handoff to Andrew Emery. Picks up the first down and more later in the drive. Handoff to Trevor McMichael. The Bearcats get on the board first, 7-0 Spencerville in front. Crestview ball now on third down. Preston Zaleski's going to keep it. Picks up about five, but it's not enough. Is Dan Galavari there for the tackle? Knights would have to punt. Bearcats trying to increase the lead. Mason Nurse back to pass, but Dylan Grandstaff comes up with a big interception. For Crestview, ensuing possession. Bearcats, Logan Vandermark puts some pressure on Zaleski, wraps him up. Zaleski fumbles. Spencerville recovers with great field position. Ensuing possession, but now in the second quarter, knocking on the door. Hand off to Zach Goki into the end zone. 14 0 Spencerville leading. Late in the quarter, Knights finally get the offense on track. Zaleski, hand off to his fullback, Jake Lippy. 44 is going to get some cold cuts. Woo! Touchdown, Knights. They cut it. To seven with 37 seconds left. Bearcats not content to run out the clock, though. Hand off to Goki up the middle across midfield. Finally brought down at the 20 yard line with just over 20 seconds remaining. Bearcats right before the half. Nurse fakes the handoff, finds Calvin Wilson, the juggling catch in the end zone. 21 7 Spencerville up at half. But that's all the Bearcats would score, and the Knights rally. Preston Zaleski, the long touchdown run. Two-point conversion gives Crestview the win. Knights pick up the victory 22-21. You can see that game coming up in just about half an hour here on TV44.